Hey, what's going on, everyone? Link's here, 1999 here, coming at you with a new series we're doing called Quest to All the Rooms of the TARDIS. Now, for those of you who don't know, the TARDIS is from the fictional, or the science fiction show, Doctor Who, on the BBC, yeah, BBC, British Channel, um, I think it stands for something, I'm not really sure, but, um, today we're doing that series, um, this is actually a voiceover, so that's why I'm really off target. This was a horse I have, her name is Whitney. I'm playing on a private server, it's whitelisted, um, so don't ask about the IP. Um, those of you who play on the server know about it. I'm gonna stash her in the my cows because someone, there are a lot of mm, jerks on this server and they keep like destroying everything that I build. So, um, let's go ahead and get right into it, shall we? Okay, so you should be able to see all the rooms that I'm able to make. I've already made seven of those rooms, and by the end of the episode, we should have nine of those rooms available. Um, again, this is a voiceover, so I know kind of everything that's going to happen. My microphone must not have been on. So that's probably the reason why. Um, if there's like double audio, then that means that my microphone was on and Windows Movie Maker didn't pick up what I had said. Um, <clears throat> so it's my fault. Um, but anyway, so this is just kind of the TARDIS, you know, I'm just showing you off everything that I have. There's the pool, here's my library, here's my vault. It's a really cool plugin. The server uses plugins, it's no mods, I'll show you that in a little while. Uh, here's the greenhouse. The greenhouse and the farm are actually two separate things, which I thought was kind of interesting. Um, here's my workshop. Again, this is all, you place down a certain block, and the plug-in, and you right-click on it with a stick, because that's your key, and you right-click on it, and it will automatically give you, or it will adjust and give you something. Um, I apologize for any lapses in commentary. I don't know what to say because I'm record I'm voicing this over. Um so um yeah. Um I'm just kinda watching it right now to see what it is I'm doing. Um okay. So it looks like my brother stopped me for something. Okay, what did I put here? Um, oh, right, I did, let's see, I did the kitchen and the work, wood, and the wood room, I believe is what I did. Um, and it does take a little while for it to load. I think on average it takes about five or ten minutes. So while that's doing that, <clears throat> um, I am going to go show you the house that me, my cousin, and my friend have built. So, um, kind of determined that the best way to do things on this server was to go underground, make sure that no one knew you were there, that kind of approach to it. Um, so this is kind of our thing. My friend added in this little obsidian thing with World Edit. Um, it's kind of interesting. He doesn't even need it. He just likes it. So, I'm like, can we get rid of it? He's like, no, I like it. So, I'm like, okay. So, we kept it. Um, okay. So, this is my room. Um, the staircase up to my room. As you can see, I kind of like the quartz. It took me a while to gather that much quartz. But, and I still need some. That dirt right there. Cobblestone. It looks kind of ugly. Um, my light switch does work. I have this weird thing. Light switches that are up need to be on, and light switches that are down need to be off. And I've inverted the signal so that I can accomplish that. Um, okay. So this is the connecting room hallway from me to my friend. Um, it's just a 1x2 piston door, nothing too complicated. Let me know if you want me to do basic redstone stuff. I know kind of some simple stuff that I could show you guys if you're interested. Um... Anyways, this is my friend Ada Graw's room, uh, Space ED on YouTube. Um, his, he also has a light switch, as you can see. It's over by his bed. Um, I'm 
I'm sorry, I'm trying to read the command of what I just typed in. Oh, I warped. Oh, right, I played a prank on him. He is, like, one of the biggest fans of Doctor Who. Um. <coughs> so for those of you who know, there's a race in Doctor Who called the Daleks. I'm not even sure if they are called Dal- if they're a race, because they're robots. Anyways, I put it in there, and, you know, the Doctor's a Gallifreyan. Um, and I just put in a giant Dalek. I built one as best as I could. Um. So yeah and then i just gave him some diamonds and um yeah i wasn't on when he did that which kind of upset me but um anyways yeah as i'll show here his lights do go er do i show it here i think so uh, yeah i do okay see he has a lot more lights than i do so his torch so like one or two torches can't be can't do the same thing for him that they can do for me this is just a little laboratory area, um, redstone enchantment. It was really not that difficult to figure out, but I'll sh definitely show you how you guys can do that. Um, yeah, this is our little sheep farm, uh, yeah. Oh, this, these are our automatic smelters. Um, I go for a demonstration here, and I kind of fail. I put the wrong thing in the wrong chest at the wrong time. And I quickly, I figured it out pretty fast. Um, so, yeah, guys. Um, yeah, uh, so down here, this is just kind of how it looks on the, on the, this is all the guts and everything. I just kind of have like a little maintenance stairway down. Uses one comparator and some repeaters, some torches, some droppers, some hoppers, and furnaces. So, um, nothing too too complicated, but nothing too too um simple. I mean, you know, you could probably just have like a. I could probably um make something a little bit more advanced than what I have right here, but. Um, you know, it's not really necessary, I think that short counts. This is our storage area. Um, my cousin Mockingjay66 organized it. it. He didn't do a bad job. He just, he categorized it into things I wouldn't categorize it in myself. So, you know, it's not really a, he didn't do a bad job. It was just kind of a, it's just kind of, that's how he would organize it. So that's how we organized it kind of thing. Uh, but, yeah. So, um, that is going to wrap up this part, um, I'm just going to cut off the narration, or the voiceover here, and then the last, like, minute and a half or so, you can skip, I think it's just me explaining our automatic smelting thing, so, um, yeah, thanks for watching this part, guys. episode of uh, quest to all the rooms of the TARDIS, I believe, or quest to complete the TARDIS, I believe is what I'm going to call it, um, I apologize, I don't know the room, um, this episode is fast forward, as you can see, this is the kitchen, it looks pretty cool, um, I learned some things, one, the server removed keep inventory, I really kind of wish my friend would have told me that, here I clear out a space for an anti-gravity room, but that was before, but I then realized that the server, or no, I mean the plugin, because I'm going to show you that this server uses no plugins. Um, I'll kind of exit out to the main menu, and you'll see that I don't have any mods installed. Um, that'll come. 
and about that part I'll slow it down just so you guys can see that and I'll speed it back up this is two and a half times normal I'll put it up to about three or four uh, it was four originally it was just being like really laggy and like I said I pre-watch these videos so that you guys always get the best content that I can deliver with my current recording settings um I mean I use a headset microphone probably not the best option out there but um whatever works um I am yeah uh so uh so I've died by this point um this is about the time where I figured out the servers removed to keep inventory I've just kind of given myself some of my more basic item, the basic items that I had. Um, yeah, I'm gonna stop the narration now, so I can fast forward it, so I'm not taking up any more of your guys' time. I'd rather it be fast forwarded. Oh, but here's the part where I show there's no mods. So, um, hope you saw that. If not, go back and rewatch it. But um, I'm gonna stop the narration. Narration here, guys. Uh, thanks for watching and enjoy the rest of the video.